Now to a killing that shook Chicago. Rakia Boyd shot to death by an off duty Chicago police officer on this very day back in 2012. The cop who pulled the trigger acquitted in a controversial ruling. Tonight, Boyd's friends and families gather to remember Boyd and the legacy her case leaves behind. Here's CBS 2's Charlie DeMar. It has been 10 years since the shooting death of Rikia Boyd, and rather than get together and mourn family and community activists together tonight to share a smile. How y'all feel tonight? It's not your usual celebration of life. Laughter is medicine, man. Well, tonight is all about laughs. Over the years, there's been no shortage of tears for Martina Sutton. I mean, it's tough. You know, you miss that physical presence, right? His sister, Rakia Boyd, was shot and killed by former Chicago police officer Dante Servin in 2012. He was off duty at the time. Boyd and a group of friends were hanging out in Douglas Park when Servin was upset about the noise coming from the crowd. Servin got into a shouting match and shot several times from his car, killing Boyd. Servin claims someone in the group pulled a gun but only a cell phone was found at the scene. Who thinks that being loud will get you killed? There is a finding of not guilty on all counts. I think it was a mistake for the state's attorney to charge me. A judge found Servin not guilty, and he later resigned from the department. No, I'm just teasing, but y'all feeling good? Organizers of tonight's event say Boyd's loss paved the way for officer accountability in Chicago. The way the judge determined that he would be acquitted led to Laquan's murderer being charged with murder. <laughs> Ten years later, Boyd proving that sometimes laughter really is the best medicine. Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News.